Welcome back guys to Hearts of Iron 4 as the Soviet Union and we have just crushed a lot of these uh, of the enemy forces on this front. Now we need to make sure that we actually get all of our troops uh, on here. We definitely need to send one of our tanks just here to, to well keep the line. Keeping the line with a tank is always feels stupid but you know uh, let's just actually attack here. Yeah never mind. So um we do need to make sure that we do not get cut off here, and in turn, we need to make sure that we encircle our enemy. Now, with these uh, tanks that we have in the south here in Iran, uh, we can actually really rush forward, and I think that's what we're going to do. We're actually going to use these two tanks to just rush to victory points. So, for example, um, both of you, I think we're going to send here, and then you will actually make a way to the capital, Ankara, and then over here, and then to... Uh, Istanbul and then the rest of you this guy I think yep we will send you to capture these victory points and I think then uh, Turkey will Turkey will probably uh, give up by then and um, I'm hoping that I don't actually have to fight anymore so you guys I will actually have you stand around here I don't really want to fight Turkey anymore because obviously I want to have them as my as my ally. Alright, let's get rid of these commands because that makes my units just walk around uh, stupidly. So you go here, you go here, um, and two tanks I want here, and the other one here as well. That's fine. We're defending here as well, and you guys, you should probably stop this. No, no, actually, no, 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 no. We need to make sure. Yeah, before we do that, we need to make sure that obviously we have someone holding this. Then we can we can stop this attack. This attack is basically just so that this army does not, or this unit does not get cut off. Okay, so once that's done, we can basically stop. All right, and we should also probably go ahead and get rid of this, whatever the heck this was. Yeah, let's just get rid of all of it. Awesome. Okay, um. That's done. We have one tank just chilling here. Don't think you actually need to be here. Yeah, especially because we have you here. So I'm going to send you back to capture the, the to hold the city. And I'll send you to attack the city as well. Actually, you might want to do that. Just take over the city as quickly as possible. And you go here. We need to keep the victory points. I don't want anyone to retake them. We are taking over their capital soon. So that probably will make Iran... Uh, capitulate. I do want to wait though. I probably want to wait a little bit though before we before we do that. Um, simply because, yeah, simply because I I want to have this extra factory. That actually that actually be really cool. When is it done? Um, I can't say, but I can say on mine. Uh, ten days. If we wait ten days and just hold on to our victory points, we should be fine. So, okay, let's let's see how close they are to uh, capitulating. Um, when it has 30 or less. I don't know how many victory points they actually have. So we're going to wait here. We're going to wait here for now. And um, you guys, I need you to stop. Yeah, you need to stop. You advance. Oh, you're being attacked. I see. All right, that's fine then. But you can stop. And so can you. Yeah, I don't need that anymore. That's fine. We'll keep you like this. And no one should get hurt. I don't think anyone's going to... I don't think they're going to take their... Retake their uh, victory points. So that's fine. I definitely want to have this city, Tabriz. They will not... They will not surrender. Um, because of Tabriz. Which is good. Okay, we caught this guy here. And you should probably stay... Actually... That's fine. Yeah, we'll attack you here. And you guys, we're just going to keep here. I don't want to kill them, but I want to neutralize them, obviously, because uh, if I vassalize, as I said, if I puppet Turkey, I want them to obviously ha retain their troops. So I don't want to kill... I don't want to kill them. Okay, you can stay here now. Um, and one of the tanks should move up, and another one will just stay here. And then hopefully these two tanks will just take over the, uh, the victory points with Turkey. Let's see how... How many points I need to take over? Oh, 45 or less. Yeah, that's not a whole lot. They don't really have a whole lot of national unity. That's great. Um, awesome. Now, in fact, I might actually declare... Well, attack this guy. 
You know what? We're going to go and cut these guys off. Yeah, I probably should have stopped here. You can go there. We might kill a couple more of their units simply because I can. Yes, that's fine. Let's go like this. Protect one of our cities. And since no one does anything with this tank, we might as well try and get for their, go for their victory points as well. I mean, just send any tank forward. We just need to capture victory points, as I said. Most of their troops are neutralized, so they can't really do much. Um, okay, so this is one of the purges. Trial of the anti-Soviet Trotsky Center. So we can um, remove Michael Kalinin, uh, Khrushchev. I don't think I need him. I don't need uh, Nikita Khrushchev because I will never use daily communism support. There's no need in that. Lose political power? Uh, no. So we're going to do that. Khrushchev dabbled with Trotskyism in the past. So you can obviously read this. I don't want to. Basically, it's just, you know, a flavor event about who I should, uh, who I should kill, basically. Okay, so you guys, you are here. That's fine. You support him. Okay, okay, things are looking, uh, actually I don't need, yeah, I don't need this, this, I don't need to control these lands, so they can take it back, that's fine. I basically just want to break through here, that's all that's important. Uh, the Hindenburg disaster, and there is the peace with Iran, so I guess taking Tabriz was enough. Alright, well in that case, I'm just going to take all states, um, that's what we're going to do, yep, take all the states. And we can end our turn and finish off Iran. Um, I don't think they actually finished. Yeah, the national focus did not finish. But that's all right, that's all right I guess. Uh, what I will use, though, I will use this unit to just take over Kabul. Because basically we've taken Herat. And that's all that we need to take. All right, you can stay. You can stay. I want you to stop your advance. There's no need. You're just going to stay at the border, and um, that's fine. You, I will send here. Yeah, I'll get rid of this. And you, I will send here. And you, uh, I will send here. The tank or this motorized infantry will take the victory point, which is their capital, and then we'll, uh, this war will be over. Awesome. And this horseman, I don't really think I need him at all. Yeah, I don't think I, I do. Um, so you can you just put him at the border here. That's fine. Yeah, there's no there's nothing I really need him for. So just go here. Don't know what I'm doing with you too. But might as well just put you here. Alright. Um, and basically all of our tanks are being stopped at the moment. That's a little bit frustrating. Uh, let's go and take this. Can I put... I can probably go ahead and put this division over there instead of the tank. But yeah, look at their organization. Dropping quickly. I probably just want to go with this guy. I'm basically just going to send them all forward and see what I can do. Because basically if I take over these points, 10 and 20 victory points. Yeah, that's going to be so much. They're basically just going to have to give up. And I don't know that they're going to try and stop me. But I don't think they can. We're breaking through everywhere. Marco Polo Bridge incident. Oh, shoot. Is someone going to help them out? I don't know. I hope no one's going to actually help them out. That'd be kind of annoying. But I don't think anyone will. That would really suck. Okay, you guys, you can stop attacking. There's no need. No need. Okay, these two tanks seem to be able to break through. That's good. That's what I want to see. No one's stopping them. Lovely. Lovely nobody's stopping them. Nice. These guys are all cut off. And, ooh. We need to make sure that we stay here and defend. And we also should probably make sure... Uh, you, where are you going? You're going here, so that means I can send you there. That's awesome. Just want to make sure that no, none of my troops gets cut off. I don't want to lose them. Uh, what about... Okay, we've support weapons. That's going to help out our infantry in pushing. And... Uh, Hmm, can't do any of this. Support battalions. I would like to go for the field hospital. That'd be a great thing. Armor. Go for the heavy or for the light tank. Yeah, actually, we're going to go for this because I've been losing... Uh, I've been using quite a lot of light tanks, so going for a second model is good. So, yeah, they have no organization. They completely ran out of organization now. Nice. 
Okay, so we're getting really... Okay, 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 that's fine. Let's just retreat, that's fine. I mean, there's, there's, there's nothing bad about retreating from time to time. And it seems as if... Yeah, these two guys are... Are making headway. Nice. So basically, all I need to do is just... Just stay back. No more attacking is necessary. How is it going, Turkey? 84. Yeah, it's basically Ankara and um, Istanbul. And then they will give up. That's basically it. Okay. Um, you look like you're going to be able to take over Kabul as well. I basically... I basically need you guys to engage the front line right now. Engage the front line. Just so that they cannot do anything. Attack. Attack. And attack. You can attack him. Okay, there's actually three. Well, maybe you two attack here. Awesome. This guy is not engaged. Seems like. Yeah. And you are sh you should be engaged, you should be engaged. Okay, so everyone is engaged. Their front line. So we only have to deal with this. Oh, Germans have just arrived. Ooh, okay, that is actually somewhat problematic. I did not really expect them. I did not really expect the Germans here to show up. Okay, that's going to delay this war for a bit. Damn it. Alright, fine. Still, though, I think we're, we're basically winning on all fronts. So that's fine. Uh, that's kind of annoying. Okay, so we're going to just chill. I mean, maybe the Germans will disappear. There's also Italians. Is that correct? Italians and Germans. Hmm. I wonder if they also uh, help out Turkey. Yes, they are. Hmm. Okay, so they are probably going to be in Turkey's capital. And they might actually stop me. That would not be cool. But so far, yeah, they're basically just going to try and defend their... Defend their borders here. That's awesome. As long as we keep all the victory points, it seems like no one's in Ankara. We've taken it successfully. And, uh, yeah, come on. You should, you don't have much national unity. You should, you should succumb. And they are, oh shoot. All right, so now they're the Italians. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. That was not what, uh, how it was meant to be. Yeah, there's more Germans and Italians. Ah, shit, I was too slow. Perhaps this tank, though. Uh, yeah, let's actually retreat and take a... Let's retreat into the city, because that's obviously a lot of victory points. Hopefully, this tank will be able to uh, to take over whatever we need. This is only one victory point. You know what? I'm actually going to make this a little bit different. Yeah, just go like this, um, because this is the important. Once that falls, I think we have it. Just need to hold the rest of our victory points, then. Nice. And uh, what about, what about the war here? Okay, the Italians are defending. Am I sending, yeah, I want you, probably, you know what? Uh, there's probably no point in doing this, but I'll do it anyway. Just so we uh, have the, a better front line. Okay, and then I guess you could go ahead and cut off some people. That'd be nice as well. That should help. Maybe somewhat. And who is this guy? This is Afghanistan, I see. Seems like we're winning, actually. Even if Germany helping out, we are winning. Okay, let's just engage with this guy as well. Winning on all fronts. Yeah, let's just go here. Maybe we can cut off some people. I really don't know if this is possible. And they're attacking us here, uh, one motorized division. Damn it, I was really hoping that this would not happen. But we have one more tank. I should probably be sending this one over here. You know what, we'll, we'll send this tank over here. And hopefully he can bring uh, victory. He can bring us victory. Oh, and, and look at this. So we are holding that capital. And we're probably going to take Istanbul. They might have a unit there, most likely. Um, but still, this is only one victory point. I think once we take Istanbul, it's going to be it. That's going to be it. And we will take over uh, Turkey. Uh, it actually does not look like they have any units there. Awesome. So basically, they have all of their other units there. Come on, take it over. Don't don't have anyone here. Okay, there it is. And that is not yet... Let me see. Nope, this is it. Okay, so next, next day. So yeah, this is awesome. So basically, we have 
we have kept all of their units intact. And that is, that's a pretty good idea. Yeah, they're actually trying to take back Ankara. But I don't think they will be able to. I think we'll be able to uh, make them capitulate. Yes. So, uh, however, Turkey is so big. I think I want to simply puppet them. I think I, I simply want to puppet them um, because they can they can actually help us out f uh, while fighting quite a bit. And I don't really need to worry about my southern border here. So yeah, you're my puppet, done, and uh, there it is. Nice. Uh, Turkish Socialist Republic. Awesome. So you are probably part of the yeah you're probably part of the comment ham. Nice. Uh, this couldn't be any better. So now our southern borders are secured. We have taken over Iran and all of their oil. And we have the Turkish Socialist Republic enabled or established. And they have a white dude. Seyfik Hüznü. Alright, that's that's fine. Um, and they're still... Okay, the volunteers are pissing off. And now it's basically Afghanistan. Who would have thought that Afghanistan, out of all of these, would have uh, survived the longest? Awesome. So with that done, I could basically... Yeah, I could basically retreat my units, and I definitely need to rename my kebab the virus. So, I I only need to have someone at the Iraqi border, and obviously on the British border. Good, so I'm probably going to send you guys here. Yes, this is what you are going to have to protect. And then we'll see where we put the rest of our forces. Afghanistan joined the Axis. Oh, holy shit. Oh, holy shit. And that is not good. That is not good. Oh, sh shoot. They're gonna call them in. They're gonna call them in. I'm gonna be at war with Germany. Damn it. Um, well, that's something. Yeah. Okay, so we're at war with Germany now, but I don't think we can actually, I don't think they can actually touch us. So, Italy joined the Axis, oh holy shit. Oh, what happened? Japan joined the Axis, oh no! Oh, 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 okay, this is a problem. I may have started things too early, because here's the thing, we're not ready, we're not ready to fight yet. Obviously, you know what, here's the thing though, they can't really do much, they can do some naval invasions, but I have my ports secured. If I hope that Turkey has has as well. Oh shit. Okay, okay. But here's the thing though. Japan. Japan is in the Axis. They're probably gonna get called in. But they do not own China yet. Oh shit. Do I have enough troops on this border? I don't even think so. Oh god. I don't even think I have enough troops here. Shit. Totally do not have enough men. Maybe this was a little bit too early. Maybe, yeah, I, I probably think that was too, yeah, that was definitely too early. Alright, well, in that case, um, shit. <laughs> shit, 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 but actually, yeah, Japan has joined. Yes, of course they have. Of course Japan has joined. Um, so, they did call in, they did not call in Italy yet, which I suppose is good. So, we're at war with Japan. We're at war with Japan, and they have three units here. Really? Damn. Damn. So, I probably... Uh, I don't know even know if my fleet is going to be able to destroy the Japanese. They probably... Yeah, well, they have all of their fleets here. Oh, shit. And we have the Great Purge coming as well. Damn it. Okay, so we are actually in a really bad situation. But I don't think the Germans... No, the, here's the thing. The Germans will not be able to touch us. It's basically going to be the... Um, yeah, it's basically just going to be the... Um, the Japanese that are going to be hurting us. Okay, so you guys... I will send here. Um, you are going to have to deal with this. Yeah, right. Okay, so... You I will send all over here. Yep, like that. Kill them as quickly as possible. Then we have our volunteer tanks. I need I need to send them as quickly as, as I can over here. Yes. And now I want to see if I can uh, invite some of these people to my faction. Why not? Base reluctance. So we're going to have to improve relations. We're going to have to improve some relations. Actually, let me quickly see what happened to France. 
the French are communist, 51%. All right, and they hate my guts. So I need to improve relations with them. I need to improve relations. Why do they hate me that much? Uh, generate world tension. Well, shoot. And what about you? You would, would you join my faction? Not yet. Damn it. Well, we're going to have to improve relations because otherwise we're going to be in real trouble. But yeah, um, oh, we're actually losing power things per day. Oh, shoot. <laughs> well, uh, anyways, I'm going to have to end this episode here. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I'm going to have to end this episode here, guys. We are at war with the Axis, Germany, Italy, Japan, and Afghanistan. So this is going to be this is going to be very difficult. We'll see how, uh, how this is going to work out. But so far, uh, I think we're pretty much fucked. Anyways, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.